What's going on, world, world, world? Once again, we back. I'm traveling in this piece of rain. It's raining really bad. Today is you know, September the 8th. September 8th. I'm um, here today, just getting off work on my way to the house, reflecting on my wonderful, crazy, long, exhausting, beautiful, entertaining, educational day. Uh, today I started off, I had kindergarten with my first group, did a lot of screaming and talking, a lot of redirecting. Um, that, that class is it's not really bad, I just have a few uh, sour apples. We just need to keep going over the routines, and they probably won't get it throughout the whole year. But my job is just to keep trying, keep, keep it going. Uh, with that class, we went over, what did we go? We went over uh, throwing, tossing. Tossing was the topic. Uh, I think uh, they surprised me. They did really well. Everybody was throwing the ball. Um, a lot of girls learned how to catch today. I saw them catching, learned, caught on how to catch. I'm pretty, really proud of that. Uh, my boys. They actually listen. Those spots that I put on the floor are uh, really helpful. The guys kind of keep everybody organized, structured. They kind of know where to go. It's not really room for uh, disruption or to get out of line, start all that fighting. So I think I did a pretty good job of being prepared. That's the key. I'm prepared. I have a decent class. Uh, also, kindergarten. No injuries. I took them to the grass. We didn't have to worry about anybody falling. So that was cool with the little tag game we played. We had a nice tag game. And everything was cool with kindergarten. I can't complain. First grade, uh, we all mixed them up. We have magnet school now, so the kids are mixed up. First grade, uh, they were really, uh, they were really, uh, had a lot of energy today. I don't know what it was about today, but all the kids had a lot of energy. They got to me, the tossing was decent. Decent. We still have a lot of uh, wind-up throws. Can't throw the ball too high. But uh, it, was, it was absolutely pretty nice. Pretty nice. Same with the kindergarten. A lot of redirecting. Um, they're, kind of, they're kind of getting into the routine of knowing where to be, where to go, how far to push me. And I think I should just start taking account of how many times I'm telling certain students to do things. I think I should get on top of that. I'm, I, I'm actually having to tell certain students to do the same things more more time than I should. But just hopefully that it decreases um, throughout the year as the year goes on. The second grade, this is with Andrew, with what Andrew in that class. Uh, not really proud of what happened in that class. That may have been the only class that I had to just shut it down continue to go over following direction because we just could not get it. I mean, we had kids who just, I don't know if they know how to follow direction. I'll give a simple direction. Someone still messes it up. I know. I don't know if I'm speaking loud enough, if I'm allowing enough time for them to comprehend it. Just even just knowing I have on a blue shirt or a red shirt, it's, it's hard for them to, to get that. I don't know, I don't know. So that class was a little difficult, but I pulled it through. Um, I was disappointed, but I made it through. I made it through, I can't complain about it. Uh, after, I had a nice lunch, wife cooked a nice meal. Uh, I'm trying to get out the microwave, but I've been, I've been microwaving it up. Hopefully Uber Eats comes out, and I can get some food delivered, some fresh food, food delivered, preferably from Central Market. Preferably, preferably however you want to say it. Uh, yeah, I think that would be an awesome benefit to my lunch. Get some fresh here that I want to put in the microwave. It's heated for those waves. I know it has an effect on your body, some kind of way. I'm not a scientist, but I definitely know that's making common sense. Uh, what else? Uh, after lunch, third grade. Third grade was that was really hyper. They were really, really high risk. Mr. Cruz group. Yeah, they were really hyper. But um, I got kinda got to him, got help, gave him a chance to settle it down. Tried to run it out of him. But you know, those girls don't want to participate. So I had to get my mission statement. That's what I need to do. 
you to get a mission statement about come out telling you, reminding you, auto, auto suggestion of what do you need to do when you come out here. So maybe they don't know, maybe they forget it, you need to participate, you need to give your best, you need to follow directions. It's only three things I really ask for you. Everything else you're going to have fun. That's what I'm designing the class for. Um, fourth grade. Fourth grade. Oh, third grade. We did go football, flag football today. Uh, it was actually not. I had a lot of athletes in that class, that hyper class I was talking about. Uh, the best jukes you ever seen in your life. I got a few of them on my Snapchat. Oh my God, it was so nice. Uh, yeah, but um, that, that class really ended, really ended quite well. I didn't have any injuries. Make a plan. Fourth grade. Fourth grade. That's the class. So many kids, abundant group of kids. So, so many kids in that fourth grade group. On this particular day, this is my best class. I get it three days a week. Um, can I complain? I can't really complain. They sat there. They was patient. Uh, they went through the activity. A few jukes. We got a lot of athletes in that class, so they was really engaged. Uh, I'm sure they had a lot of fun. I'm glad we got that out the way, so now they can do more playing. Hopefully it don't rain tomorrow, so I can get some nice activities for them. I have some things planned for them. Um, and that's it with fourth grade, uh, Tamaya Brooks group. I like that group. Hopefully I get a lot of them on my basketball team and my soccer team and volleyball. Man, I'm about to be busy. Hopefully that all works out. And yeah, we can go from there. Fifth grade, my good old fifth graders. Yeah, man, they had a nice time today. But I did have an injury. I had uh, one of my girls doing a flag tag. You know, bumped her head. What's that, fourth grade? Oh, no, that was fourth grade. Fourth grade. She bumped her head, she had a knot on her head. And she was the student who I was just directing, telling her to pay attention. Talk about safety. She was not listening. She was sitting on the ground, not wanting to participate, not doing her best, not paying attention. Guess what happened? She had a bump on her head. But yeah, today was pretty nice. I can't really complain. Wish I had more water. Hopefully, my sore throat goes away from coaching. And um, things should be good. Rain is letting up. Almost at home. Probably just bringing Starbucks. Hopefully, we get some heat together. And we end the day off right. Uh, last note, uh, looking to get into a, a reality show for my my um, all my teachers. We're trying to get a reality show with our teachers. We call it the uh, teachers, real teachers of H Town. Real teachers of H Town. Sounds like a good topic. Um, come up with some ideas. If you have anything, let me know. Like, subscribe. I left your boy.